Hello, Lola's. So I am going to um, see if this girl can fit this little outfit while I talk to you guys. Um, don't forget, you guys know, don't forget to make sure that you are subscribed to my channel. Make sure that you give this video a thumbs up and make sure that you leave me a comment below. Um, I got a message from YouTube um, stating that they are doing away with the um, private messaging, which probably would explain why some people are saying, oh, I didn't get your message or why well, I had a hard time trying to find where somebody PM me. So they are doing away with it. I've heard some people have already lost theirs. So um, if anybody try to send me a message, you have to send me an email through Miss Serenity Smith at yahoo.com or you have to private message me on Instagram or Facebook. My name is Miss Serenity Smith on Instagram and on Facebook is Serenity Smith. So you do have to message me on there, not on YouTube for any future cases or whatever it is or purchases or anything else like that. I did have a baby up for sale as a boo-boo baby, but I decided to, um, I got several inquiries, but then I just decided, you know what, it's not that big of a boo-boo for me. And I, um, decided that I was just going to go ahead and if I do sell her, I'm going to go ahead and work on her a little bit more and then I'll just put her on eBay for sale. But she won't be at a boo-boo price because I'm going to go in and do a little bit more work to her. I was just selling, trying to do a quick sale and so I had a price down really low. She was one of my rooted babies. She was Harlow um, by Laura Tussa Ross. And so, I don't know if she's going to be able to fit this now because this is 0 to 3. But, oh, guys, at Bye Bye Babies, I bought these diapers. They're Pampers brand. And they're pure, called Pure Something. And they're really soft. And they got a really, really soft print on them. I love, like, the soft um, diapers. That's why I love the new Huggies print because it's very, it's not really bold. You know, I know, like, I will put them on like the prints and everything, but I like the, the subtle ones because no matter what you put them on, it doesn't like stick out, but that's just me. And you know, I could have taken her t-shirt off, but I keep it on just so when I'm changing her, people don't see the cloth as much. So I just um, usually keep it on. But a lot of people ask about like different sizes with babies. That's why it's kind of hard to to um, gauge the size a baby wear because it depends on the brand. Then not even with the brand, it depends on outfit because I've put her on as big as nine month size in Carter's. In fact, I like to buy her nine month size in Carter's in like the sleepers and stuff like that. But then she can wear their six month stuff as well. But then, you know, some places, this is a zero to three. I bought this from Marshall's. I think maybe it might be almost a year. Not, it's been quite a bit of months. And this is zero to three months. And look, it, it fits her like perfect. So I'm gonna button her back. But yeah, um, I'm thinking about if I get a chance, guys, if I get home in time enough and do what all I need to do, maybe go on live Wednesday at 8 o'clock, maybe 7.30, between 7.30 and 8. Just look out for, for me Wednesday night just to hang out and chat and catch up. Um, I know the only time I've been going live mostly is doing the court but I don't get to really interact with you guys as much while I'm doing the court because I don't want to get off track or distracted so I tend to kind of I read your comments but I don't really respond to everybody comments because I have to you know keep it moving because I'm trying not to keep everybody long on that so 
I want to hang out with you guys Wednesday night. Let me know in the comments below if you think I should keep it at 8 o'clock or 7.30. I try to give everybody time enough to have dinner with their families, get the babies tucked in, and then come and hang out and we just chat while you guys are doing whatever. Not only that, I have, you know, Gabby on schedule and everything too and that kind of helps me be a little bit more focused. So, anyway guys, I just wanted to pop in. She got wild hair. I don't know, you guys can't, might can't see. But yeah, she got, she got wild hair. But, um... For those that may not know, she is the partial silicone Gabby Gale by Claire Taylor. I think most people know that by now, but sometimes I get new subscribers, so I just mention it anyway. Um, she is the silicone version. However, I think it's still some kits left of the vinyl, but they do come in the vinyl form where you can paint them. So, and I've painted 11 of them, and I am not going to paint anymore. My boy... It's just waiting on here. He pretty much got a mommy that's commit that's committed to buying him. But um, if she well, she got first option to buy, and if she don't, then he'll go on eBay. Um, but that's my last Gabigail that I'm painting because I've painted eleven. So and right now I'm working on the Abigails by Laura Tudor Ross, which is I love that kit, and I'm doing two of them right now. So. Stay tuned for that. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching, and we will see you guys in the next video. Don't forget to let me know about the time, guys.